when this thing first happened, when they grabbed these two guys up, right? And people was hitting me and telling me, hey, listen, man, the Cornelius dude, he's a he's a car thief and a woman beater. He's not a shooter, he's not this, he's not that. The the straight drop kid, he, he fired a gun before. They sent me the link to the article. Okay, I see he had a semi uh, automatic weapon, pulls up bowling alley, sees his target, target right in front of him and he missed. So straight drop can't shoot straight. Cornelius Smith never fired a gun in his life. Especially that gun. Remember the prosecution asked him, did you did you ever fire that gun? No, never fired it before. No. So based on the information that was given to me about the these two stooges. I said to myself, how the hell can Big Joke, I want y'all to listen to what I'm saying, because a lot of people caught up right now and they want to spin the block. Listen to Sean in HD and make it make sense. If I'm Big Joke, a old head street dude, okay, an old head street dude, I was questioning why would Big Jook hire those two idiots? You you hear them talk, right? They got low IQ, especially Cornelius. Just by a conversation alone, I know Jook gonna be like, I can't let this fool do that. I said, wait a minute. The way the, they paint in the picture is as if Big Jook hired these dudes to do the hit. Or paid Govan to mastermind the hit and he didn't hire those two. That's how they making it sound. But look at Cornelius Smith. Look at the other idiot. You I really think Big Jook sat with them and said, yo, these are the guys I'm going to use. Oh, these guys are great. They awesome. Oh, they good for this job. You think Big Jook going to give this fool a gun he ain't never shot before? So the play they trying to do is make it sound like yo Gotti put up the money. Big Jook is the brother and he's in the streets. He has street ties. Govan, he got to go with Govan and they plotted and schemed that this day we gonna get Dolph this day. That's not what the hell it sounds like. It sounds like to me, Big Jook didn't even know the damn hit went down because he ain't never hired those two Stooges, I believe Govan, Big Jook probably, you know how men talk. Yeah, old Dov this and Dov that. Yeah, I'm going to put 100,000 on his head. Govan was there. Word. 100,000 on Dov's head. Then... Cornelius Smith and Govan, time, time went by. Here comes Cornelius Smith and Govan having a conversation. And then Govan said, yo, you know Big Jook? Yeah, I know Big Jook. Yo, he got $1,000 on Dolph's head. $1,000 on Dolph's head? That's when Cornelius Smith had the bright idea. Oh, word, I'm, I, I, I'll do that. Yeah, 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 I'll do that. Call the other idiot. Yo, 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 straight trap. Yo, yo, there's a thousand, 100K on Dolph head. A word, word, son. All right, all right, we know that turkey drive coming up. Yeah, 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 okay, okay. Yeah, 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 all right. 
Turkey Drive is in effect. Car, uh, uh, straight Drop comes, pick up Cornelius and say, yo, let's just go by the Turkey Drive and rob them dudes. There's, there's rappers out there. Yeah, let's go rob them dudes. They driving. And while they driving, they just so happen to see Dolph Carr. Oh, yo, yo, wait up. Yo, that's Dolph right there, bro. That's Dolph right there. Follow Dolph. Jump out. Cornelius Smith, you see them with the gun. But look how he holding the damn gun. And look how he's shooting the gun. You could tell he didn't know what he was doing. He got lucky. Was lucky shots. Now, if you see straight drop, straight drop look like he know what he doing. He had a better handle when he was shooting. So, I believe after they did the hit, I don't even think Big Jook knew they was doing the hit. I don't even think Big Jook knew them. I don't even think he know who they are or ever even spoke to them about no damn hit. So after they did the hit now, they must have went and told Govan, yo, yo, Govan, yo, yo, we did it, yo. Yo, we did it. We did it. We got Dove. And even he didn't know. Oh, word? Y'all did it? All right, all right, all right. Easy, easy. Yo, 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 go far, man. Yo, yo, tell, tell, tell him we need that money, man. We did it, man. Why the hell you think they, they didn't get paid for the hit? Why do you think they didn't get paid? Big Juke ain't paid them. Even if the way that, even if it's the little eight thousand, it's nothing compared to a hundred k. I don't think he was prepared. What? what? Govan must have hit him. Yo, 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 big joke. Yo, yo, these two dudes. Oh, uh, this guy straight drop. This guy Cornelius. Yo, 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 they got Dolph, man. Got Dolph. Yeah, remember you said you put a hundred thousand on their head. Yeah, but I ain't hired them to do nothing. Who them? Who them? Who them? Who them two? I, I, who the hell are they? I ain't hired them to do nothing. If I wanted to kill Dove, I would have hired a real hitter. Who them? I think that's why they didn't get the money. And that's why he's saying what he said. Now, is, is he glad that he's dead? Yes. But now he's like, damn, I, they could be the boys. They could be. That's why he was making excuses. Oh, I got to pick up my kid. I, I got to do this. I got to do that. So understand that's my theory of what happened. I don't think Big Jook sat with these guys directly and hired them because Big Jook is an old head from the streets. He would know, wait, these dudes are slow and retarded. I ain't hiring them. They acted on their own because they heard the hit was out there. They acted on their own. Doff would have been alive. Think about this. You telling me Big Juke couldn't pay a real hitter? If Big Juke wanted Doff dead, Big Juke would have got a real hitter to do that. I feel like Big Juke, like every other man, yes, he, he didn't like Doff. Yeah, he probably did want Dove dead, but he run in his mouth, say, yeah, I'm put a hundred thousand on his head. Think about it. Why would Juk need these dumb people? Juk could have hired a real hitter, give him the hundred K, you'll go kill Dove. And that's it. Case of, it's, it's over. But he that did not happen. Yo, man, y'all gotta think, man. But I don't like what the law are doing. It's like they're trying to say, God he had the money. Gotti put up the money. Big Juke is a street dude. That's Gotti's brother. Being that Juke, Juke is street, but Gotti's the bag. And then Juke sit down with Hernandez and these two clowns, and they put the whole play together. Yo, y'all better, y'all gotta look. Yes, okay, they're mixing truth with mystery to fit their agenda. They wanna start a war in Memphis. 
Listen to what I'm saying. I'm not saying Juke innocent. I'm not saying that. But look, Juke didn't hire these fools. Juke didn't say, yo, yeah, this day going to make the hit. They acted on their own, bro. Because a real hit don't happen like that. It would have went where, okay, you get half of the money now. And when y'all do the hit, I'll give you the other half. But that's not what happened. Jook probably didn't even know what the hit happened, bro. Because he never hired these dudes, never planned directly with them, never said on this day y'all going to do the hit. That never happened. They acted on their own. In fact, they were even driving to go rob other rappers, but end up seeing Dolph just by chance. Oh, there you go. There goes the 100K right there. Here he is. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Y'all got to think. Big Juke ain't innocent, but we got to keep it real. Did Big Juke hire these fools or did they act on their own unbeknownst to Big Juke? Because we do it all the time. Even some of y'all argue with y'all baby mothers. And you like, oh man, I want to kill her, yo. People say things, bro, because you mad at the person. Dudes talk all the time. Yeah, yeah, I'm put a bag on his head, yo. I, I, 100K, yo. Okay, then why Big Juke never just hired a real hitter to do it? He would have been got off. These two clowns, because of Hernandez, Govan. Heard Big Juke say he got a hundred thousand on Dolph head. He done tell Cornelius, oh, you know Big Juke? Yeah, I know Big Juke. I heard him. Yo, you know he got a hundred thousand on Dolph head, right? Oh, word, word. Yo, 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 that's me, son. I'm going to do that, son. I'm going to do that. Call the other idiot. Word, hundred thousand? Yeah, I'm down. How much? Word, Govan just want ten from me and ten from you? Notice you don't hear nothing about Big Juke directly dealing with them. But the law is trying to make it seem like Gotti and Big Juke is directly linked with these fools. R.I.P. Young Dove. Y'all need, this is why the game need me, yo. This is why the game need me. Listen, military minded, one. Two, I got to vet every situation. Three, I see the European agenda right here. Divide, cause confusion. They want to start a war. They want to start a war in Memphis by making y'all think Gotti, Big Juke, sat down with these fools. Okay? Gotti put up the money. Juke is the street connect. And he got Govan. And Govan hired them too. And it was all a play. Man, stop playing. But at the end of the day, at the end of the day, wrong is wrong. It was wrong for Big Juke to say you're going to put 100000 on Dove's head. That was wrong. But how can I say that was wrong when these two men are beefing? Dove threw, threw words at Juke too. He, just, he threw words too. His hands ain't clean either. He participated in the nonsense. So we got to learn from this so that the, 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 the next rapper or whoever or the, the, the youths won't repeat the same nonsense. Because it's all dumb. This man lost his life by the hands of uh, two dirty, bummy, no good. Look, look at these dudes. Come on now. Imagine you lose your life by, by the hands of the... Look, Dolph would still be alive if they didn't decide on their own to do what they did. Big Juke didn't sit down with them and say, I'm hiring y'all. Big, Big Juke didn't sit down with Govan and the two stooges, okay? Govan, who's, who they trying to call a mastermind, remember, they every time you hear Govan name... The news, the prosecution, the law, the white people say Govan is the mastermind. 
They trying to paint this damn picture. When we, when you hear Govan talk and the dumb things he has done while he was in there and they even gave him an opportunity to bail and, and, and wear the ankle and he messed that up doing dumb stuff. He's an idiot. And y'all want me to believe that narrative? No. They want to make it look like Gotti put up the money to his brother. His brother then hired Govan and these two and say, yo, this is the day because it's turkey day. Go do the hit. We don't see that evidence. What we do see is two fools that heard a man say there's a price on Dolph head. Oh, we want to have money. And they decide to go do it. And then now they want to get paid. But nobody hired y'all. Nobody sat with y'all and planned anything. And you wonder why they ain't get no goddamn money. So that's what I believe. That's my theory. Other than that, young Dolph not here. Regardless of anybody's theory, regardless of what happened, Adolph ain't here. Memphis took a hit because he was a financial situation that had vision and 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 if they didn't kill young Dolph Memphis would, Memphis would be different in the next 20 years you know, look what 50s doing the street Shreveport Shreveport Louisiana what 50 is doing down there is what Dolph was going to do for Memphis y'all don't see that short in HD man I, I've been saw the man's vision that's why I, I I I respect the man. I respect he's a family guy. I respect he, he took care of his family. There's a lot of rappers they don't take care of their family. There's a lot of dudes that take care of their family. I respect he got himself a black woman. You know what I'm saying? Because when he died, the black family gonna eat. Okay? Black people gonna eat. No, I'm not trying to say white people this white people that no. Understand that we I see enough rappers that go outside the community and take care of other people outside the community, even throw money away in the strip club and stuff like that. So I respect Young Dove, and but I know the man's vision. I know what he was trying to do. You see what 50 is doing? I'm going to say one more time. What 50 Cents is doing in Shreveport, Louisiana, is what Young Dove was going to do in Memphis. Facts.